Hey GC, I'm Aiden Dick. It is Friday, April 29th. And I'm Christina Bell. Let's get into your news. Club Group 2 meets today during academic time. That's the Art Club, Future Farmers of America, Interacting Key Club, Beta Club, and the Young Politicians. Head to your meeting places at the start of academic time. Seniors, please, I need your pictures. We need them for the senior video. They don't just have to be some from seniors, but we want pictures of seniors and their friends hanging out and making memories. You can send those to us at the email on your screen, wgce.gctv at gmail.com. You can also send them to us on Instagram at GCTV Studios. Seniors, make sure your parents or guardians have filled out their senior salute. Those need to be completed ASAP. You can find a link to do that on Toolsy or in the most recent email sent out to GCHS families. Your teacher should also be letting you know you still, if you still have forms that need to get filled out prior to graduation. Talk to one of the guidance counselors if you're not sure. It's almost time to give up your Chromebooks. I say almost because we still have to get finals out of the way. There is a schedule for when each grade is supposed to turn their Chromebooks and chargers in. Seniors, you turn yours in on May 8th and 9th only. Freshmen and sophomores turn theirs in on May 11th and 12th. Juniors will be allowed to keep their Chromebooks over the summer. Now there is a form for your parent or guardian to find, fill out. You can find that in the most recent GCHS family email. Our last story today. We want to wish the JROTC Raiders a good luck this week. Yep. That's because they are traveling to Western Kentucky University for a competition. The Raiders won several awards and honors last year. Here's hoping they'll bring back more on Monday. Good morning, GC. I'm Gage Tucker with Sports. A second win for the Eagles baseball team in district play. They shut down Mayfield 10-2 last night. Tonight, Lady Eagles softball heads up to Ballard Memorial. Will JV and varsity play starting at 5.30? And track will be in McCracken County. Saturday is about bass fishing out on Kentucky Lake, and our GC fishing team will be there. Softball hosts Crittenden County, and baseball hosts Webster and Trigg County. That's all for your sports. Back to you guys at the desk. Thanks for that fascinating sports info, Gage Dale Tucker. And thanks to all of you for watching GCTV. Have a great rest of your day, GC. We'll see you back here on Monday.